and of course, of course they drive right through it and uh geez. holy hell Woo. oh yeah has that have you tried that yeah yeah that looks pretty cool huh let's go look at it again that's the one uh with the winter storm yeah probably Fun little trail. <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty cool one. Where does it uh, lead to? Um. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of quartz out here. Yeah, there is, isn't there? forest rides like this is pretty cool we're in the forest it's, you know what this kind of reminds me of uh, auto mirrors yeah. yeah there's places like that so i know i haven't been riding my beta 350 double r too much but that is because i bought this bike solely for the purpose of being my snow bike Eventually, um, I'm waiting for these tracks to come out, which should be coming out next year, and I'm going to place that on this bike and see how it goes, because we do get a lot of snow, especially out west and a little bit more north of Colorado Springs, so I'm just out here chilling, test riding the beta, make sure nothing is wrong with it. I'm not gonna lie, I really like this beta. And the 350 double R, you might say, hey, this 350 probably doesn't produce enough power. But it does, it has one hell of a kick. But the only downfall to this beta 350 double R, honestly, is just it flames out so easy. Now, it could be my bike, cause I did buy it used, it's not brand new, and I'm sure a brand new beta would not flame out this quickly give you an idea my KLX 250 and my DRZ 400 doesn't even flame out that quick I'm out in second gear and just if I get the revs just low enough even when I'm going somewhat fast it just shuts off on me but it's all good definitely makes you better at the clutch I like this road this road is so much fun Fly by. <laughs> These are like the blind corners I'm scared of. Right here. Oh, we're already here? Holy shit. Yeah. I was going like 22 there. But call it what you will. Beginner error, which indeed I am quite a novice rider. But maybe I've gotten used to my two stroke where. The DE 250 just rarely flames out. It really struggles to flame out. It just wants to keep going all the time. While the Beta 350 Double R, just as soon as you think you have enough speed, before it dies, it shuts off. But it's okay. This bike really makes up its torquiness down low and especially when you really want to rev it up, this bike definitely goes. 